In this video, I'm going to show you how to perform a suspension height calibration on a Land Rover LR4. This procedure is required when the suspension is serviced. For example, you replace a ride level control module, RLM, removal or replacement of a height sensor, or lower control arms. This procedure can be confidently performed using iScan's native diagnostic software. We'll review the process as well as how to prep the vehicle prior to the procedure to ensure a valid calibration. Before beginning, all suspension-related faults must be remedied. Be sure the wheels, tires, and suspension are in good working order. Open window and route your iScan cable through the window. With the vehicle idling, raise and lower the suspension. Then, set ride height to normal and allow the system to finish adjusting before continuing. Move the vehicle to a level calibration surface. An alignment rack is great for this. Steering wheel should be straight ahead. Place the transmission in park with the parking brake on. No persons or heavy objects should be in the vehicle. Tap Diagnostic. Tap Euro. Tap Land Rover. Tap Service Function. Tap Automatic Detect Models. Confirm vehicle info is correct. Press Enter to continue. Tap Service Function. Tap Chassis System. Tap Air Suspension Height Calibration. Read and understand message. Press Enter to continue. Read and understand message. Confirm all prerequisites are met. Press Enter to continue. Read and understand message. Press Enter to continue. Read and confirm message. Press Enter to continue. Start and idle the engine. Make sure all doors are closed. Press Enter to continue. A crosslink valve check is performed. Beginning with the front left wheel, enter the measurement from the center of the wheel hub to the top of the wheel well. Be sure your tape measure is plumb. Select OK. Next, enter your measurements for each wheel. Once each corner measurement is entered and the compressor cools, the suspension will be adjusted. In our example, the tolerance is larger than three millimeters, so we will select OK to start the calibration. You will receive a confirmation message if successful. If you do not achieve a successful calibration, the option to enter your measurements will reappear when you hit OK. Remeasure while being as accurate as possible, then enter the measurements again. Thanks for watching. Check out our other videos for more technical tips and procedures for Land Rover vehicles.